You want to do some training? Okay, let's do it. When it comes to dog training, usually treats are used to motivate your dog into certain behaviors. However, depending on the mood of your dog, you may be able to train them using different forms of motivation. In this video, I'll show you how to train your dog through play rather than food. Play can be a strong motivator, but typically high value dog treats are what corgis value the most. Therefore, these training sessions should be focused on tricks or behaviors that your dog already knows rather than new behaviors. You can tell Gandalf is extremely focused on the ball right now, so he'll be ready to do some work while we play. I'll typically warm him up by simply playing with him. We call this game small ball. After a few minutes, he looks very happy. You wanna do some training? We start out our session with a number of basic tricks. We then work on some impulse control. Leave it. Go get it. Good boy. Lastly, we work on some base training. Yes, good boy. Ready? On your back. Good boy. Ready? On the box. Good boy. Ready? On the box. Good boy. Ready? On your back. By the end of this short session, you can tell the motivation was starting to fade. Therefore, have low expectations and just have fun without being too ambitious. Little short sessions like this can go a long way. Give it a try next time you play with your dog. Okay. The great thing about doing this is that you exercise your dog physically and mentally. Like I said before, a tired dog is a good dog. Yeah. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, please give us a like. We genuinely appreciate your time and attention. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.